Welcome to the Science Channel! Science? Yes, sir! We got a ballistic torso, ballistic dummy lab hooked us up with these ones. There'll be a link in the description for them. They make these super realistic human body ballistic gels. It's got its organs inside. Uh, we told them to put the blue color inside the organs, so if we shoot them, it's supposed to you know, bleed like a normal kind of circumstances. <laughs> it's got a uh, synthetic bones and just better give me a side angle of this one. Super thick. Oh, I can see screws they put in there to uh, put the bones together. That's pretty cool. And uh, obviously I'm not a doctor. I'm a scientist. So I don't know what these organs are called. I don't know which one is the liver. Ah, come on, like okay. That looks like maybe a heart in there. Lungs. Heart is in there somewhere in the back probably. This, this is the... What's What's this thing you hear in the bottom? Ah, uh, intestines. intestines. Yeah, in that's where the intestines. food goes through and everything. Yes. Okay, good. <laughs> you know, because I'm not a doctor. I, I know, I know. Yeah, yeah. In, that's where the intestines. food goes through and everything. Yes. Okay, good. <laughs> you know, because I'm not a doctor. <laughs> I, I know, I know. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks to Alex from SB Tactical for sending us this uh, MP7 with Mark Serbu. He brought it over, thanks to both of them. There will be a link in the description for both of those guys. The SP Tactical, they make these braces. And uh, also Mark Serbu's channel, he does uh, gun stuff. He designs guns. You know, the 50 BMG stuff. And uh, this thing is super cool. I've been wanting to shoot one of these forever. I couldn't find one. And uh, no, not too many of these are on the market or anything like that. And if there are, they're in thousands and thousands of dollars. Okay, just Betty, ready? I'm ready! We are gonna go full auto. Full I think auto? There's like 30, 40 rounds in here. Oh, 40, I think, yeah. And uh, let's see what happens. Uh, you wanna kill I don't know where I'm gonna aim exactly, but I'm gonna go for the for the top. The top part. Come where on. The boobs are. Okay, ready? Wait, wait, wait. I'm on, okay. I'm ready! Uh, ta da, fire in the hole. Oh, I didn't charge it. <laughs> fire in the hole. Where'd I go? Did I miss? Oh, it's hitting center, okay. Oh, it's accurate, okay. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> You killed this Let's port. clear this guy. Okay, this is clear. So as I mentioned, the blue dye in there, it's a representation of your blood. You see the bullets. Oh, right there, there's some bullets stuck in there. Can I yeah. poke this thing? Be careful with your fingers. Oh man. Shoot. Yeah, it came out. He's bleeding, poor guy. Yeah. Wow, I didn't know the 4.6 is that good and penetrating. That's a small, tiny bullet. He is completely dead, but <laughs> we're gonna pretend he's not there. I don't, this is like the movies where uh, he, somebody gets shot and all of a sudden on the bottom you start seeing blood everywhere coming out. It's exactly like that. And we got demonetized. <laughs> no, I don't know. We got two 1911s that are full automatic. Thanks to my friend Richard, he converted both of these legally to make them automatic. Okay. One is loaded. The other one is loaded. Ready? Double double 1911s automatic. Hopefully I don't hit the metal. Wait, wait, hopefully, uh, record from where? Uh, I, I don't know, record from over there, Garo. No, if you hit the metal. <sighs> Oh, are you sure this is controllable? <laughs> uh, what if I hit the metal? Let me shoot from here, uh, camera. Okay, ready? I'm ready. One, two, three. <laughs> okay, I had a little jam over here, hold on. Let me go another, I'm gonna hold this one with uh, both hands. Ready? Ready. Okay, fire it off. Oh, <laughs> oh man. There they are. 1911s, automatics. <laughs> oh man, that was awesome. Okay. We got more blood coming out. More ink. More ink, more ink. 
Did they come out? Yeah, it looks like there were some more damages. The holes keep getting bigger. Any bullets stuck in there? No, no bullets. Oh, here's the something. Oh, here's the uh, 45. Came out. Oh, man. Yeah, they're coming in all kinds of places. All right, next, we got a Desert Eagle chambered 44 Magnum. And thank you so much to Underwood Ammo for hooking us up with some extreme hunters. They're always helping us out. If you are looking for ammo for this big boar stuff, check them out. Big caliber. And they're super cool looking too. Shiny, Jasperi. I like shiny bullets. <laughs> awesome. Yes. Thanks to our friend Richard for uh, making this automatic for us. Can still carry this one. Okay. Fire in the hole. Catch him. I think it's cold like last time. I don't know. Oh, yeah. These gotta get going warm up a little bit before they can function correctly. <laughs> it looks like they were coming right out. Went in right over here. And exit it from the back. <laughs> the screws, <laughs> just made the screws are falling apart now from inside. <laughs> That's pretty cool. We don't have any bullets here on the ground, do we? No bullets, but big holes here. Yeah, we got some huge holes on the top, here inside. Uh, pretty nasty. All right, let me get some other rounds. This thing is taking a beating. Pretty cool. I'll be right back. We got the G3 HK shoots the 308 this bad boy and this is also automatic. That's pretty ready? I'm ready. Okay. Lisa! I'm ready. Fire in the hole. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. That is kaput. Kaput. My way. Oh man. Oh man. Look, Look at, at the intestines, just ready. Not only the intestines. The intestine. bones, ribs. What they make these from? Gelatin. Oh, plastic. Oh, this stuff is hard. Oh. Ugh. Thank you again to Ballistic Dummy Lab for hooking us up with these ones. Yeah. Ugh. This is gross stuff, slimy. I like it. Okay, that's it for the video, for this one. Poor Jasperita is holding this little cardboard thing on the side so the wind doesn't... <laughs> so the wind doesn't make it as worse because you guys are going to have to sit there and watch this. So. You want the I make this thing for you guys. Yeah, exactly. We make this thing for you. We really appreciate all of you. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and as always, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Ah, okay. Vámonos.